Good morning. So, this video is all about photographing seascapes and trying to get a quite kind of minimalist feel to the shot. Um, I'm at Burnham on Sea today, and it's a, as you can see, a really kind of flat, dramatic, beautiful um, landscape. And it's got these incredible lighthouses. So, let's see what we can find and go and take some shots. Okay, let's go for it. So I'm set up for the first shot of the day and the sky is just beautiful, the clouds are coming past and uh, the, the lighthouse is really starting to kind of come into its own. Now just as I start filming, the light changes, it's a classic, but anyway. Um, so I'm set up here, I'm just doing some handheld stuff to start off with. Um, I've just been taking um, shots at um, f11 on 250th of a second on ISO 100, nice and easy. And it's just really trying to get this lighthouse to a point. I don't mind the people, I think it's, it's all part of it. The people, the seagulls, everything else. <laughs> and it's just trying to get that, light, that lighthouse to an interesting compositional point. Now, it's also about waiting for the light. The light has changed. So what I'm doing, um, Technically, I'm using a um, continuous high shutter speed, and I'm um, and I am uh, bracketing it with three um, different exposure points, just because, especially in these harsh lighting conditions, it's really, really important to bracket for the sky and then bracket again for the ground and the details. So let's see what we can do. We might need to wait a little bit for the light to change slightly and wait for that cloud to start kind of rolling in again to change the feeling of the scene. Okay, so I'm set up for my second shot of the day. And this is one of the um, famous Burnham on Sea lighthouses. It's a fantastic structure and it's really interesting the way it kind of, I don't know, it looks pretty kind of stark against this this uh, seaside, it almost looks like it's made for it, you know? But um, let's see what compositions we can find and see what we can photograph. So again, I'm going to look towards um, using this as, um, really going to look towards using the rule of thirds with this one and placing the lighthouse within the rule of thirds to try and get that interesting composition. Okay, so there we have it. Um, wonderful Burnham on Sea. I mean, it's like a kind of desert out here. Look at it, it's incredible. The light going across the sand and just this beautiful kind of minimalist space. Um, that lighthouse is something special and I think this area is really kind of underrated, really interesting. But in terms of seascapes and composition, it's really kind of working with those lines, celebrating the flatness, celebrating the blue skies, trying to get it as minimal as possible. I've taken, uh, as you can see, I've taken a, um, a few photographs um, using man-made structures, using natural structures as well. And I think one of the most important things about seascapes is trying to kind of work with its character rather than be frustrated that there's too much blue sky or not enough foreground features or whatever it is. Just go with it a bit and, uh, and celebrate the character of the seascape that you're photographing. So, there we are. So please like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.